Give me a good, clean fight. Obey my commands and protect yourselves at all times. 154 in his fourth title defense. Immediately switches to lefty. You'll see him with his jab. When he landed seven Charles chin, but you know, being cautious. Excellent performance against Dervianchenko. You can see the jab coming, and next you know he lands. Jab. I think he's being smart now. He's switching at a. Charlo fresh off for arguably the he had that tremendous there's a right hand to the body left hook upstairs he's just missing with the right uppercut is Charlo good bobbing and weaving although Montiel Charlo going to the body and, and Charlo really just picking his punches It's like this crowd under 30 seconds left in the second round. Load. If Charlo's able to make. Swing and a miss by Montiel as Charlo landed the left. You commit with one, he makes you miss, he makes you pay. We're here as Charlo again works behind the jab. There's a right hand. But he's an awkward fighter. It's the way Charlo described him. With the one, two. Body landing at a huge percentage, but throwing more certainly. Montiel trying to parry the jab there. So I'm not saying it hurt Charlo in any way, but Charlo a left hand from the southpaw. There's a left hand land. That's the, the issue. Took to the body by Charlo, and that forces Montiel to throw it as a as a righty and, and, and get some leverage in it like that. Momentarily go back, and now Charlo beginning to open up on Montiel. It's that right hand. When he switches left hander, he doesn't. There's counter right uppercut in the pace and the terms of this fight. It's been a fun round. Oh, and Montiel lands a left and a right. Then the Montiel taking those punches well so far. And Montiel, though, as we end round three. Belt making his fourth defense against. But he's got to be careful. He keeps telling us. Charlo extremely focused. Again, in a distance where he doesn't get countered by Jamal. Left to the body by Charlo. That straight right in the way he likes. That was a nice one to the body. Yeah. Montel has been taking some shots from Charlo. Money punch, I think, yeah. for him in this fight. Right hand gets through the guard, left hook and for Montiel. And a right. Both go to the body. Power of Charlo here in round four. 45 seconds left in the round. One tube splits the guard by Charlo. Now, I would like oh, to see right a little hand bit more. Oh, and there's a one two. hit him with and not gone down. And again, though, Montiel <laughs> utilizing his footwork and eats that. Um, Montiel. Final minute of the fifth, and again, Charlo. There is a righty and countered the left hook of team 15 and four, so taking care of business. There are levels. Inability to land the, the big fish at 160 as we head to round six. And Way, which is a right hander. <laughs> that would that would be a help too. Oh, the right hand that landed for Charlo. A lot of time for him to get through. Montiel says, "Bring it on!" <laughs> Trying to defend the attack, the left gets through on the ropes. A crowd on its feet in anticipation. Right hand to the body by Charlo. Point to make a mistake. Montiel appears to be fading and in trouble. Hands are down. Now up the right hand. Scores. Comes in looking to land the one-two, lands another right hand. And now punching and back. Coming back with lefts and then comes left in the sixth. Shoe shine and then the left hook upstairs. Montel got a really good body shot. In. 
Montel's only been down once, and that came against Bo That hurt Montiel. Jab and then the left hook. You're, you're asking for it against a guy like Charlo. You are. Demonstrate, uh, you know, what's going on here. Uh, and I heard in an interview, he said, I give myself an A. And wow, Charlo. I'm sorry, Mo, but it, it is what you do against a fighter. His stance is not on point. Montiel. Oh, he's taking the few shots here and there as well. But Charlo shows a great chin. Punches in this round, so he's very fit. Oh, and he got clocked with that right hand. Attack the body and the head. 160 pound title, an unheralded challenger. These thunderous shots from the champion. Tell him that. No, it makes me want to go tell him. A chance to win this fight in any case, but an ounce of boxing intelligence should see that. Oh. Left uppercut by Charlo. I mean, you're so right. There's no use for him to go soft. No. Yeah, is it, what it is. Exactly. Pounds. Now here at 160. himself off balance after his, his yes. stance is and yet the left uppercut and the oh, left wow. hand and another left hand Montiel <laughs> talk, talk, let's talk about the great conditioning <laughs> left hook to the body by the challenger much me what is trained for the fight in Tucson Arizona what a round here in Houston Montiel continues to fight from the southpaw stance. And it's amazing, I mean, where every performed exceedingly well. It's that Montiel has just been, these last couple of rounds have been exciting to watch. But you know, if he doesn't get the knockout, what's going to be happening? The fight is different. Here's a guy that was knocked out at 147 by Mugia. Here in the ninth round, double jab by Charlo, that right. Left talk thing. The body work of Montiel. The jab by Charlo walking, walking backwards. Whoa. Yeah, and Charlo's 4 0 is it in. Continues to walk forward. Charlo has landed at 47% of his power punches. There's a straight left right eye of Juan Montiel. Oh. Left hook again. You will get a hand here and there. Oh, stiff right hand from Montiel. Eats the right through the guard. A double jab followed by the right cross. And now Charlo. He jabs his way for him. There it oh. is. Would make it to the championship no. round. Couple of left uppercuts. Right cross by Montiel. Meeting the challenger Juan Montiel in the center of the ring. Montiel's made it to the championship rounds in this fight. Anything that you would like to see the champion Charlo do? Or jab. You can win a whole round by a jab. Sinaloa, Mexico. And again, it's a body petite. There's the jab. On here, past the midpoint of the 11th. Wow. Left up a cut. And it's coming. That body shot hurt him, guys. Backing up to the ropes, baiting him in, leafed in the 11th. Charlo attacking, but it's still something to be said. Crowd showing their approbation for earning respect. Fascinating part is Montiel coming forward. Yep. He's taking punches. Around. Which obviously he didn't, but the character he's exhibiting. And meanwhile, Charlo now bowing his spirit. And Montiel continues to bring the fight. Man, many believe to be the best of 160. To Charlo, Charlo able to counter effectively. Staggers him with the right hand before. And the crowd wanting to rally Charlo. It's been a long time since we had. Man Montiel continues.
Oh, Chuck!